to both of you. Thank you for being so disgustingly in love. <laughs> for showing everyone on a daily basis how beautiful and special a Christ-centered relationship can be. Kimmy is a perfect extension of Keith. I couldn't have imagined a better match for my brother. Kimmy is just simply easy to be with. Keith and Kimmy, God knows exactly what you both need to go through to be sanctified and be more like his son. And uh, may you guys both go through the hard times and the good times together. Ephesians chapter 5, we learn that God's number one command for you as a husband is to love. We see a picture of Jesus' love for his church as the model of a groom to his bride. In this scripture, there are two key words, just as. The husband loves his wife just as Jesus loved his church. I, Kimmy, take you, Keith, to be my husband. I, Keith, take you, Kimmy, to be my wife. I promise to live first under God. To help you grow into a life of peace. I take you to have and hold from this day forward. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. Till death do us part. Till death do us part. Keith, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is my privilege and pleasure to now introduce you all to Mr. and Mrs. Keith and Kimmy McCauley.